my business. Bomb till I bomb. Bust until I did it. I think I'm dead. Geek, geek. Stay around my business. I live in Jimmy Jimmy's making money. Test in it. Every day I pull a crown. All I want to do is bomb. What is going on guys? Hope you're all having an amazing day just like I am. It is another trip to the thrift. Went to hit up about three thrift stores as well as pick up a couple Supreme pieces from my dad's house. So let's just jump right into it. Today's outfit, I'm wearing the Florida Marlins 1993 inaugural. Let's get it! So if you guys didn't realize, I replied to every single comment on my channel as well as on my Instagram. On my Instagram, I follow every single person that follows me back. I'm not gonna be one of those YouTubers that have a million followers and following zero people. On my vintage store Instagram, at D-I-T-R-954, I promise if you follow me, I will give you a follow back. Mark my words. As well, as if you put something down below in the comments, I am gonna reply. I wanna try to talk to you guys, you know? I wanna know what you guys wanna see, I wanna know what I should do better, what you guys like, what you dislike. You know, just let's be like a, let's be a family on here. I don't want to be that guy that just uploads and does, like I said, I, I want to actually communicate to you guys and whatnot. So make sure you leave comments and uh, check out my Instagram. I'm launching my website tomorrow, guys. So just be ready for it. Just be ready. So the first store we're pulling up to is Goodwill. Let's hope they have some fire. So as soon as we jump into the jackets and sweaters, what do we see? Vintage Tommy, size small with the crest there. Then we also see this white with teal raincoat. I don't know if you guys can see, it's like a it's definitely a raincoat with the material. It's like a poncho style with the vintage dolphins. Let's get it. Quickly just jumped over to the shirts. We got University of Florida Champions, 1991. Little stain right there, but I think that should get out. Cop. So I just saw this Jordan shirt. I usually don't cop Jordan shirts, but look what it says. I feel like this is so sick. I failed over and over again, and in my life, that's why I, I succeed. I think I'm gonna cop this for personal collection. It's a size large. I feel like this is such a dope quote. Like, I, I definitely back this up. I'm definitely copping this for myself. Got this sick embroidered Mickey playing baseball. Vintage tag, but unfortunately, it looks like someone tried to do the DIY vintage and put bleach on it. So I don't know, I think, what size is this? This is an extra large. If this was a large, I'd probably cop it and do like a personal DIY. Maybe I still will. I'll think about that because that, that logo is sick. So I'm not sure if this is vintage or not, but it is an AN1 1993 basketball as well as AN1 1993. And like I said, 1993 is my birthday or is my birth year. So I feel like I'm going to cop this for sure. Highlighter Toucan Sam. Damn. Vintage Nautica jeans, slight cracking on the front. It is an extra, extra large, but it honestly looks like it's an extra large. I think I'm a cop this. I'm actually gonna pass on this. If you notice, look at the collar. Someone had a fat neck. <laughs> Marlin stuff for days. 1997, National League champions. Size extra large, pro player, cop. Vans, Vans. Pro model? Adidas. Those are so ugly. Ah, what do we got here? Nothing, nothing. Converse. Found a vintage Helly Hansen jacket. I think it's the girls though. Unfortunately, there's no embroidered nothing, just like a plain jacket, so. Yankee hat just chilling. Dirty as F. That's actually pretty sick. Looney Tunes with the Santa 1996 damn I think this is a cop dollar yeah I'm copping America I'm sure most of you guys don't even look in the mugs 
I'm not sure if you guys are aware, but Polo Ralph Lauren does make mugs, and they are fire. So I always check out the mugs just to get a quick rundown. I haven't found one, but I always see pictures of people finding one, so I know I'm gonna find one one day. So I think someone got salty and really disliked the Yankees, because look at this. We got this one. It looks vintage. It looks vintage, or that's just really yellowing, I'm not really sure. And we got this one, New York City, Yankee on the back. All black. UC, World Champs. Oh, this is brand new with the tags. Pinstripe, Yankee. Another all black. First uh, haul, I would say. Got a big bag, spent $11, so I was pretty hyped. I found more things that were half off that I didn't realize it was. Today's color is blue, I thought it was orange, so we get in it half off. Now we're gonna go to another Goodwill, so let's get it. So I know I just said I'm gonna hit up another Goodwill, but I'm actually gonna go to Salvation Army instead. I didn't realize how close this one was by me. This one's a smaller one. It's not as big as the one I was at yesterday, but I do find a couple of good things here and there, so let's go get it. So today's sales, white 50% off, yellow 25. You know we're looking for that white. I'm gonna jump into the t-shirts first this time. Sick rock, paper, scissors, Disney shirt. Brand new with tags. Unfortunately, it's a 2XL though, so it is too big even to sell. I found this new age Tommy Hilfiger V-neck. The flag on the side. I'm gonna pass on this though, just because it's a V-neck. Just found this sick Reebok Red Wings hockey. Little patch on the side. Brand new with tags. And then Howard 35 on the back. Cop that. So I usually never check orange. But look, I'm glad I did today. Tommy Hilfiger Athletics. Tommy Hilfiger size large. That's a cop for sure. Just found this sick Marvel's Comics tee, brand new in a medium. I really wish this was my size. This is so sick. It's like a football player. Brand new attack, size extra large though. The number on the back. I'm gonna cop this for the website. One of you guys extra large, this is a good find for you guys. And there's another patch at the bottom. Just found this vintage goose Miami Dolphins jacket with the dolphins on the back. But they are asking $23. They are out of their mind. This is literally the same jacket we just found at Goodwill, but for FSU colors. Same brand, same everything. That's crazy. Tommy, Tommy, Tommy! With the leather patch. I was walking out of the fitting rooms and look at this dope Tweety Bird poster. They want $10, but it's all cracked and everything. This thing is sick. Another huge success. Got a big old bag, got a lot of goodies. Today's a whole lot better day than yesterday, so I'm really happy. Now on to Goodwill. Final store round three. Let's get it at Goodwill Store. Damn, Daniel. Signed vintage dolphin hat. Oh, let's get it. First thing we see is this color block chaps, Ralph Lauren, vintage red, white, and blue. I have so many polos though, so I'm gonna pass on that just because I don't think that you guys buy collared shirts. Then we got a vintage Mickey doing golf again with the Dolphins colorway. Again, I'm gonna pass on that just because it's a collared shirt, 2012. Damn, this is so sick. 
Phillies in like a velvet 1880 World Champions. But this thing is so big. One, two, three. 3XL, Jesus, this is like a dress, but damn is this fire. So someone definitely had all these together, like Eagles, Jersey, Stitch, Troffer, but if you notice it's like fraying, so I'm not gonna get that. But then this dope Brazil vintage polo, XL with the horse, Brazil on the back, definitely a cop. Then we got a vintage Boston Celtic shirt right behind that. Someone definitely was hiding this, and I'm copying it. Vintage 1995 Miami Dolphin shirt. Definitely a cop. Another sick embroidered gold Dolphins vintage. 13, you know who 13 is? Dan Marino. Ooh, what year do we have on here? 1990. Let's see if I can try to focus so you guys can see. 1990, wow. Definitely a cop. Tommy, 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 Tommy. I love when I find vintage striped Tommy Hill figure shirts. Size large, I'm definitely keeping this. Another sick art, the Sopranos. I want $8. Again, it is scratched up and everything. I'm gonna pass on that. That was another huge success. I'm walking out with a big duffel. I actually found this Calvin Klein duffel bag. It is ridiculous, so I think I'm gonna just keep this got this for eight bucks so today was an awesome day I found so many good things now I'm gonna get some food go home and show you guys what I got what's up guys we just got back to my house and today was so much better than yesterday I hope that you guys enjoyed today's trip to the thrift they said it was a lot better I did find some good finds so let's just jump right into it the first piece we got is that Dolphins jacket that I showed you it's like a puffer Goose style jacket with dolphins on the back. It's really sick. This is a size extra large. It will be on my website for sale. Like next we got like this Aztec print hoodie. Uh, it has some writings on the side. I'm not too sure of the brand, but I saw it and I thought that it was so sick. It's a natural native born. Uh, it's we built this city, so I'm not too sure about it. But like I said, I couldn't pass that up. That was super sick. Next piece we got brand new with tags. Is this soccer? It's almost like a jersey type, but if you notice, you put your head so it looks like you're the little guy with the number nine on the back. I'm really surprised that I found two colorways of the same exact jacket at different stores, but this raincoat, vintage FSU, like the color block on the sleeves, a hill figure, orange jersey, hill, hill figure athletics, brand new with tags, Reebok, Detroit Red Wings, number Howard number 35 color block Marvel's comics got all of them got spider-man and whatnot the Hulk and to wrap up that bag we got a Lacoste polo in like a blue colorway sorry about that <laughs> 1996 Looney Tunes mug Probably gonna keep that in the first collection just to have a cool mug. I don't drink coffee, but just why not, you know? This is what I was talking about, saying two colorways. Now this is the same jacket, the color block sleeves, vintage dolphins, like a raincoat. Perfect for South Florida because it's always fucking raining here. New York snapbacks, or sorry, New York fitted hats. We got the navy blue, got the old school logo, then we got the pinstripe. Like I said, I'm probably gonna put these as a pack because they are. 7 and 1 fourths, all of them are, so I'll probably just do like a package deal for all three of them. Probably one of my favorite shirts that I found just because of the quote. And I honestly want to say it glows in the dark, so let me see. This does not glow in the dark, it just kind of looks like that glow in the dark color. 1997, Florida Marlins. And one, 1993 basketball. Probably gonna do a custom uh, bleach on this shirt, since it already has bleach marks on it. It looks like by accident, but I'm just going to throw a ton of bleach on this. It's a uh, vintage Mickey playing baseball. The last piece for this bag is this 1991 Gators champion shirt. And I just realized that it has on the back Gators and all the opponents that they beat. 
that's it for bag number two. So this is bag number three. Like I said, I did find this Calvin Klein duffel. I'm not sure if it's vintage or new age, but it is huge. For eight bucks, I couldn't pass up. Has like leather on top, it's really nice. Oh, what do we have here? A package? Why would you have a package from Goodwill, Emilio? Well, let's open it and see. Oh, bam! We got Supreme. No, it wasn't from the thrift. Like I said, I picked this up from my dad's house earlier. Let's see what we got in here. Yes! Woo! Hell yes! I wanted this sticker so bad when I saw it online. So psyched. I also got the undercover dolls. The Anarchy. Generation Fuck You. And then of course the simple box logo. But I am so hyped on this. I can't believe I got this sticker. My boy actually ordered Supreme the same week as this and he didn't get it as well, so thank God. Oh, the shirt is the anatomy in a white. It has the blue logo, Supreme. And as you can see, undercover Supreme. It's probably one of my favorite collabs that they did. I feel like this is such a sick drop. Ooh, we got another package. You know. Yes. Woo! They are killing it with the stickers this time. Got another one. Got another generation fuck you. Box logo. Undercover dolls. And then the anarchy put in a blue. I love this color. For this shirt, we got the samurai in the blue. Or sorry, the black with the blue. Supreme right there. Love this. Like I said, this is probably one of the best drops that I feel like for t-shirts, besides like bogos and whatnot. Get back to the thrift though. You like how I threw that Supreme in so that way you couldn't just skip to the Supreme? You know, yeah. Got this vintage Tommy Hilfiger. See vintage tags. With the yellow and white striped crest on the left tit. Vintage dolphins embroidered with uh, Dan Marino on it. Nice embroidered gold. Got a 1995 Dolphins Vintage. This is one of my favorite shirts that I found. This Brazil Vintage Polo with the patch on the side, the, pole, the horse right there, 14, and then on the back, Brazil with the 14. And last shirt of today's find is this Vintage Boston Celtics. I'm not too sure from what year this is, but this is a really dope t-shirt wraps up my trip to the thrift today today was a lot better than yesterday's fine so i hope you guys enjoyed if you did make sure you give that thumbs up if you're not subscribed make sure you're subscribed tomorrow friday today's thursday tomorrow will be friday i'm dropping my website over 300 pieces is finally going to be added to the website it's first come first serve i know a lot of people have been asking about certain items so you want to get there early so make sure you're subscribed make sure your notifications on because as, as soon as I launch it, I'm gonna post a YouTube video, like a three minute video, just saying, hey guys, it's up, go get it, go get the stuff before it sells out. If you don't see the item that you want, maybe shoot me a DM, but more than likely, it's probably sold out. As well as I have a whole lot more inventory that I'm gonna be uploading as people are buying. So I'm hoping to have a website that's always gonna have like 300 pieces, 200 pieces. So, it should be good. I'm really excited. I've been waiting for this moment for like a year now. So I'm, I'm just so excited. I can't believe that it's finally coming true. Glad I could share it with you guys. Again, this is EMC. We enjoyed today's trip to the thrift. Now let's get it. Protect the fleet, the plan.